I have always enjoyed the challenge of applying different statistical theories to new problems where I don't, didn't have any past experience because I felt like with my research skills I could overcome those hurdles. Having this broad knowledge you actually kind of get to see how all this information intersects across different disciplines um, to solve really important problems. With predictive analytics in order to really study problems you need to have something to observe. And for life, health, and PNC, you know, the claims process is a really important process. So predictive analytics tries to tie the occurrence of claims with attributes that are occurring kind of real time or near real time when the claim occurs. But predictive analytics is really about uh, non-traditional type insurance attributes about the person to predict the likelihood that you're going to have a loss on that individual. And because of my staff background, I get to, I get to solve problems that probably other actuaries, you know, life actuaries may not um, have access to. And I build models for PNC companies. I work on um, modeling for health companies because life, they're kind of going at it from a different perspective and that they're using a lot of predictive analytics to help um, do assumption setting and understand behaviors about policyholders that impact how they utilize their, their policies. So they're using a lot of marketing data to help them understand A, how people like their information. They're using a lot of biometric data to understand um, how people are sort of maintaining their, their level of health, sustaining themselves health-wise. And I think that's going to uh, help them, you know, do a better job of underwriting, you know, a particular life that comes along. You know, particularly in for life, life actuaries, I think it's really important for people to step outside their comfort zone, you know. Hang out with people who don't do what you do. I think it's important for people to constantly look beyond, you know, their borders. Uh, so that uh, you know they can compare what others are doing, how what others are doing can actually help them solve their problems. So skills transfer, interpersonal skills, you know, strong analytical skills. I think that's what actuaries need to focus on.